So how to restart the page number on different pages in InDesign. So I've covered this subject quite a few times on my channel and we're going to go over it just quickly again. So in the parent page, we're going to add an automatic page number, create a text box, add zero one, I'm going to change the font so it's a little bit bolder and we're going to make it bigger so you can see what I am doing. Center that, bring it to the bottom. Okay, so we've got us like dummy page number there. I'm going to add a special character now. Double click on the text to highlight it. Go down to type, go down to insert special characters. We've got marks, current page number, and that will add this sort of A symbol. When we go back to page one and we keep adding pages, it'll start adding the page number at the bottom automatically. But what if you want to say, have one to five and then start again, like one through five. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, and then on page six, we want to start again. What we do is right click and we go to numbering and section options. And in here, we can then start the page numbering again. So if we go to this little uh, click option here, click on that and you've got this uh, number one here. So it'll start again from one, click OK. And it's like an override uh, box warning thing. Just press OK. And now you'll see it starts at one again. So one through five, so one, two, three, four, five. And then again, it starts one, two, three, four, five. So that's how to reset your page numbers, starting from one again on Adobe InDesign.